Hey everyone, Dennis K here. It is day 28. Day 28 of our 300 kettlebell swings per day for 30 days quarantine challenge. Hope everyone is doing good. You know, one of the things I've come to appreciate about this 30 day challenge where you're doing something every single day for 30 days is it really allows you to build up some momentum and it avoids those uh, those days off where you take a complete day off and you have to start again when you come back to the gym. So I know a lot of people uh, work out say three or four days a week and then take two or three days a week off and that's fine but I think what a lot of people don't realize is people that like to work out three or four days a week don't take an entire day off. It's certainly not two or three of them, but they might engage in lower impact exercise. So maybe they just take a walk, ride a bike, do some swimming, do some stretching, something like that. They might take a day off from their heavy workouts for their intense workouts from their HIIT training, but they really don't take any days off from training. And uh, these 30 days here, over the past 28 days, I made the mistake of taking one complete day off. It was a Sunday. I was sore. I was tired. They don't want to look at those kettlebells any longer. This is towards the beginning of the, uh, the challenge. And you know what? That one day off messed me up for the next 48 hours. Uh, so now I've been keeping with it every day, doing my 300 swings, sometimes breaking them up in different ways, sometimes making it easier on myself to do, sometimes really pushing it and going for a, uh, a reduced time crunch, make it uh, more difficult, really push the heart rate up. But uh, I'm learning something through this challenge, and that is don't take days, to, don't take days off completely off because you lose your momentum. So it's day 28, we got what? Day 29, 30, two more days to go. So we have tomorrow, Sunday, Monday's the big last day. I'm gonna come out with a full report as far as what I feel uh, I've accomplished, what this has done, and uh, hopefully you guys are gonna do the same. So take care, have a great Saturday. Hope you spend some time with uh, friends and loved ones, if not in person, then uh, over Zoom, Skype, FaceTime. Make sure you connect with those who are important to you. Uh, tonight, Steph and I have a Zoom call with my brother and his wife and kids, my sister and her husband and their kids, my mom and dad. So all of us are gonna jump on a Zoom call together, have a uh, couple snacks, maybe a glass of wine or two, and just uh, remember what's important. So I hope everyone's doing well. Again, have a great Saturday, good weekend. And get those swings in. Talk to you tomorrow.